Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith. Let's have a look at importing MKV files, finally, in Adobe Premiere Pro. All right, MKV files are pretty big out there. A lot of people use them, and it was always a pain if you had to convert those before you can import them into Premiere Pro. Now you can if they are H.264, not 5, not H-E-V-C. It's just H.264 support. What does that mean? MKV files, just like .mov, they're a container, and they can contain many different kinds of files specifically H.264, 265. There's a big difference. Adobe only supporting 264 at this time. So let's import some. So here's a bunch of clips, um, MKV files. I'll select them, drag them in. There they are. The import, drag them into my timeline. There they go. Yay, 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 yay. All right. So that's those files. Let me just, I should have brought the whole folder in. Um, I want to bring in this collection here, which is a bunch of random stuff I just found on the internet that, that are all MKV files. So I'll bring them in and I'm going to get an error that I can't, some of them are unsupported or damaged. So let me just, uh, whoops, let me also put those in a folder. Um, and we look at those. So they're all supported. Which ones weren't supported? Um, so this is footage of uh, YouTube concert, that didn't make it in. This HDR format didn't make it in. And this HDR did not make it in. How come? Well, I'll put a link to Media Info um, in the description. Media Info is your friend. It is the unbiased view of the clip that you're, you want information on. So if you're trying to find out if it, why, what, Information about a clip, good or bad, media info, um, and uh, you can use that. So I'll drag this in. This is the HDR 10 plus MKV, and you'll see Matroska. That's the MKV format. That's what it is. Oh, and there it is. HEVC. That's why that didn't go in. Um, this one did, which is HEVC. That one didn't work, H-E-V-C, which is H.265, and the U2 clip, same thing, H-E-V-C, did not make it in. But everything else does make it in. This is new uh, support. One last thing I'm gonna show you, and that is a different way of importing. If you're used to dragging and dropping, you just saw that it worked. Let me delete these files and use the import mode. I'll select all of these. I've got nothing turned on import. Let me drag these in. Let me play this. Do they work? They work. They work. This morning when I was testing twice Premiere Pro crashed when I use the import mode. I just want to tell you, obviously it didn't do it now. I cleared my cache, so it was probably a cache issue. I thought 
Maybe if it was if I could get it to always crash in the import mode, then I would tell you to drag and drop instead. But it looks like the import mode is working. MKV files are supported in Premiere Pro. H.264 uh, video and audio. Uh, if H.264, if you have video and audio, it, it will import and work. So uh, Adobe obviously will uh, update this in the future and probably support 265 um, going forward. Hey, if you found this informative, uh, take a moment and subscribe. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to uh, take one for the team and crash a little bit in the morning and then get everything fixed. So uh, just so I can show you that MKV files, yay, are finally imported and work great in Premiere Pro.